remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel at NGN TV Nigeria. Click on the subscribe button and be the first to get notifications. Last Saturday, people of Edo State went to the polls to cast their votes in search of a governor to govern them for the next four years after the end of Governor Godwin Obaseki's tenure. After voting concluded around the state, it was clear that the people of Edo State had taken their destiny into their own hands. The exercise, which was largely peaceful, and a contest between the APC and the PDP clearly produced a governor of the people's choosing in the person of the APC candidate, Senator Monday Okbewolo. Okbewolo Monday of APC, having satisfied the requirement of the law, is hereby declared the winner and is returned elected. In an election that was keenly contested, Senator Okwewolu trounced his rivals from the PDP, Aswe Gudalu and Labour Party Olumide Akpata with a total vote of 291,667 while they trailed behind with 247,274 votes and 22,761 votes respectively. Interestingly, the exercise defied earlier projections from analysts who had anticipated a high likelihood of violence. Both political actors and the electorate have largely commended the conduct of the election. However, some challenges were noted, such as the late arrival of electro materials at certain polling units and technical glitches that caused delays in a few areas. Meanwhile, Yaga Africa and other civil society organizations monitoring the elections echoed similar concerns. According to them, the collision of results at the state INEC office violated provisions of the Electoral Act, suggesting that the results should have been collated at local government offices before moving to the state collision center. A Doe state created from the defunct Bendel state in August 1991 has had a complex political journey since its creation. Following a brief democratic period from 1992 to 1993, the state was governed by four military administrators until the return to civilian rule in 1999 when Loki Igbenidium, under the People's Democratic Party, assumed the governorship seat. However, the PDP's grip on Edo State was shaken in 2008 when the court overturned their candidate, Professor Osareme Osumbo's election victory paving the way for Adam Oshomole of the then Action Congress of Nigeria, ACN, to become governor. Senator Oshomole, a former labor leader, later joined the All Progressive Congress, APC, where he successfully helped install Governor Godwin Obaseki in 2016. Their once close relationship, however, was fractured, leading Obaseki to defect to PDP, where he won his second term. Meanwhile, Obaseki's tenure saw internal strife within the fall of the PDP, particularly after he anointed Aswe Gudalu as the party's flag bearer in the 2024 gubernatorial election, a move that caused a mass exodus from the party, including his estranged deputy, Right Honorable Shwaibu, who then aligned with APC's candidate, Senator Okpewolu. As observers have noted, Obaseki's tight grip on the PDP may have significantly contributed to its poor performance in the recent election, marking the end of the party's dominance in the state. Inside the Niger Delta, 